Hi everybody, how are you today? I'm Patricia and I'm here to talk to you about how to get your twin to love you. Okay, there's a lot of people that, you know, are getting really baffled about what's happening and what you have to understand is you're going to feel like you hit a wall, but here is what you need to do. You need to reach and feel from the inside. Why is that? It is because the connections for your light body, you have special chakras that are only intended to connect to each other and not really the outer world, not really people who might be your soon to be exes or spouses that you're kicking to the curb or trying to kick to the curb. One of the things that is uh, not recommended is the confrontational method and of course just spilling your guts. That's like the kiss of death. I don't recommend just going up to someone that you might feel and just be like, you're my twin flame, we have a mission together and you need to get your shit done so that you can be with me. Don't recommend it, okay? That is not the way to woo people. That is not the way to magnetize and manifest everything that you need to actually support you. There's also, here's something else. How do you get your twin to love you? Okay. Part of this depends on you, not just holding space because holding space for certain things is completely unnecessary. You can't drag dead bodies and dead baggage and dead relationships with you. You can't make nice with the people who harmed you and abused you, okay? Family is a little bit different and even with them, there is a process for you as a twin flame. And I'm here to tell you that twin flame is about love. There are people out there that will say, it's just about making yourself a better person. No, it's about making two people better people who are drawn and flow back into each other. That is the direction of this. We're turning a corner here with the solstice and you have to know that the bar is being raised. It's going to be a challenge for you if you're not engaging your light body. What is engaging your light body? You have to open the channels that let things flow in deep inside your body, deep into the connection points, open them, you know, like, pop them open, enliven them, and start to exchange energies. Not from just from above. It has to be from above, and it has to be across to each other, and it has to be excluding other people who in the past probably have siphoned the life force out of you. Next thing you need to know is this love is a higher form of passionate love. Now it gets deep and it gets high and what has sufficed for love has become a bit corrupted. You know, people say they're in love or they will say they love their spouse and they may love them in a brotherly or sisterly way. What they do not love them in is a passionate way. They do not move heaven and earth for that person. Yeah, maybe they're a good provider. This happens a lot with people who still have traditions from ancient cultures. I know because I'm Catholic, you know, we were raised Catholic. You're to find a nice Catholic boy. You're to, you know, settle down, pop out children, not use birth control. All the, There's like a whole list of stuff, right? Now you find out you're a twin flame and there's a whole other list of stuff. So I ask you, who is that soulmate? Are they friend or foe? People who are raised Catholic actually do we've been discouraged from beliefs in reincarnation. And yet I find this is really the main reason for a lot of things. Why people repeat patterns? Why do they fall into the same relationship? Why do they divorce and attract exactly the same type of person? Here is one of the keys. If you are attracting the same type of person, like you, it's a new person, but you find it's the same stuff, the same baggage, the same issues, the same challenges, it is time for you to join my class on Twin Flames versus Soulmates, where you will find out the distinctions. You'll find out things about the dating game out there. You'll find out things about synchronicities, what they mean and what they do not mean. You'll find out why some of the lists... Okay, why some of the lists that people say like, 
You know, how do you know it's your twin flame? And if you're going by just mental energy, that's not going to cut it, okay? There is an energetic of love. And if you have fear when you feel that person, <clears throat> that's a red flag right there. So you need my class. You need to learn how. Now, this is particularly helpful for people, I would say, like, that if you are out of a marriage and you're not sure, I mean, there's a whole boatload of things you need to know. You need to know about, you know, how to avoid the pitfalls and challenges, how to avoid the people that will just drain you again, how to avoid the people that are just looking for their mommy again or their daddy again. There is a reason because those people are carrying those patterns deeply in their hara, their sacral, and some other areas. And they teach you how to clear these. The way that I teach and heal people is actually through your new twin flame body connection. It's not through your mind. There has to be some explanation and logic for the mind. But it reinforces it even more when you experience it and you feel it. I'm here to help people with high-level experiences so that you know what it feels like to be kissed by the etheric twin. You know the difference then. And no soulmate will ever cut it after that. So that you dream of being passionately pulled in for an embrace. And even if you feel like searching the earth for that person, as I did, and I did, I was looking for love in all the wrong places. Believe me, I have like been and done because I didn't know this stuff when I was 17, 18, 19. But I was looking because it was already starting to happen for me. Are you like me where you have this inner urge for love? Not just love, but it feels like you're here to be with someone. Well, if so, click the link below. Join my class. Find out much more. Find out how your light body actually not only like rescues you, heals you, but actively protects and deflects you from the wrong intentions. The people that are a pitfall, the people that are the gigolos, the ones who want to drain you for money and resources. I mean, let's get real about this. In the 15 years I've been doing this, there's a lot of people who have, you know, sunk their money into something that they get absolutely nothing, and they've lost that money. I actively want to help you learn and do and develop your light body so that it is there for you to not only empower you, but to pull you in the direction, to magnetize you, manifest, all of those lovely things. Magic, manifest, magnetize. Maintenance. Even the money that you need to make up, okay? You want a full divine partnership. And that divine partnership is only possible with your brand new divine connections. And it's, you know, we're not talking about like slicing and dicing labels, okay? Well, we're going to go over that. But to get to the main gist of this, you need to know this mainly because you need your light body opened, okay? There is a brand new thing happening here. It is brand new for Earth. It is new under the sun. It's never been done before. It hasn't been done in ancient times. But carrying around ancient traditions, that's not going to help you. That feels like lead weight. Get yourself into the mode where you feel like a lover. You want to be a lover. You want the love that you're here for. You want the things that actually are nagging at you from the inside and tapping and saying, come on, come on. You might feel a sense of urgency. This year is full of a lot of energetic pushes to do and change. And mainly, I take a lot of pride and joy in helping people transform themselves. Taking people from being hermits to being outgoing and enjoying and getting their joy back, taking people from being suicidal to really feeling themselves again and recapturing their spirit. It's time to recapture your spirit through love, feel the passion, remember what that feels like. You have a body, it's your twin flame body, it remembers love. So please join the links are below. Hope to see you there. Bye.